can see I will not be particularly uh, objective in this matchup. I myself am a Pikachu main, so I will not lie. I will be rooting for Murph somewhat. All due respect to Dom. Both great individuals. In the meantime, it looks like we have this matchup appears to be going on. Let's see so, how much sorry. patient Murph has in terms of getting this matchup. It looks like Sonic uh, PG Dom had a lot of good spacing at the beginning. Um, Murph slowly, I think he's trying to catch on. Yo, he was like, you think you're pretty quick. I got my quick attack. Ah, uh, yes. Quick attack from what I know. Ooh! It's a little bit of a misspacing there on the, uh, on the forward smash. That could have been... Really, really good for Dom had he been able to hit that. Now, in this matchup, how does Pikachu rack up damage? Largely, unlike probably a lot of uh, matchups for Pikachu, he has to play incredibly defensively, depending on the Sonic. He can get stuff off of up tilt if the Sonic goes more aggressive and get his combos. If he sits back like that and just keeps going for that spin dash, you pretty much what you're supposed to do is to sit back and camp with Thunder Joel because Sonic does not have much of an answer for that. Alternatively, if you think you can catch him with an up smash high percentage, you can get the kill out of the spin dash, as I actually have gotten a couple times. Now, I thought Murph was going to up smash right there. I wasn't sure if he could do it, like, it would be enough time. But after he fell with the forward air, is that, is that a combo? That is a combo that should work at certain percentages. Um, it's probably not a combo that he's going to want to pull out right now, because Dom is only at... 72%, which means that will not kill. Wait for him to get a probably a 90 and expect that to potentially kill here. Now, with all of the rolling, how do how does Pikachu usually deal with that? Just, Just Thunder Jolt. Thunder Jolt. Yeah, the Sonic matchup, as in the case with most characters, is a game of patience. Which means if you're the Pikachu player, you have to go pretty much against your type and you have to play back, play very patient. And don't let Sonic take the uh, first stock because he can uh, really can punish you. Yeah, and Sonic closed out the first stock with the back throw. Um, it'll do that at 150 against Pikachu at uh, almost 100 rage now. Yes. And you can see here, nice down air right there, countering act that spin dash. Now, Murph, I typically see him use thunder. Like a good amount, not too much, but a good amount, like a right amount. Um, but he didn't really use it in this game. Is it hard to play that Sonic? Against Sonic, potentially, you had to get it off of a throw, usually. And he just hasn't been able to get him in the position to get those thunders. That's been the main thing. If you want to be able to land an up throw or like a down throw near the ledge, guess that, like one of those up throws. Oh my goodness! Wow. That's that was. Pretty nice. Yeah, really good read there by Dom. I'm not sure if he was looking for that non-spike hitbox, but nonetheless, a downer sour spike will uh, will kill. And that was that's an interesting thing. I have never personally seen that. I've only seen Sonic's go for the, uh, the up air, up the up air finisher, and for the down air to come out and actually hit the sour spot. That was pretty nice. I yeah. think. You have no idea whether that was intentional or not, but... I don't want to say anything. I'm going to say it afterward. Okay, this is a little surprising. Yeah, I would not have brought a Sonic to Final Destination. If I was a Pikachu, I would go out to Dreamland or Battlefield against a Sonic and make use of the platform to counteract the spin dash. That's what I was thinking. But maybe Murph... You can see Murph is attempting to... You can see he's going for those jabs, attempting to figure out how to uh, get rid of that spin dash. It makes you wonder how much uh, experience he has against some of these players. I have a feeling that Pikachu just has to sit back, get ahead of the damage game, and then just make Sonic come to, come to Pikachu. Yeah. yeah, the matchup for a certain aggressive Pikachu players, it is not easy because a lot of their mindset is just attack, 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 where Sonic's just go run, run, run. You can't really play that kind of, uh, you know, attack attack game against Sonic because he will really punish you, punish you hard. Yeah, he has He's enough speed to where he can punish you for making one little mistake. You 
see that Harp is doing relatively decently, getting a lot of those down airs. That would have been a nice is. forward smash off of Sonic if he landed. Yeah. Two frame was unsuccessful though, and ooh, that could have been a forward smash right there. But as it is, we continue, and and Murphy's going for a lot of. There's down to oh, that will be a stock. Yes, looks like he was trying to snap back the ledge, and unfortunate to see that. At the beginning of the stock, I've seen a few Sonics do this. They put the up B right where they fall down, so then they have to waste their time. Oh, uh, yes. To do that. Yes, I have seen that. I think I've actually had that happen to me once. Uh, oh, nice. Yeah, that jab. Yeah, you can see right there. Ooh, he gets that. Not enough, though. Not enough. I don't know if he got the full. Uh, now, I luckily he got the full hit. It was just good the eye, I think, by Dom. That it's got to be a little disheartening for Murphy. He got the read. He got everything else. Oh my and uh, Murphy's got to be careful when going down for that. Sonic actually has some tangibility on his up B, which means, unlike most characters, Pikachu cannot edge guard him particularly well. I get the feeling he just does not know this uh, this matchup that well. He's playing incredibly aggressive, still looking for that first kill. You get the feeling that Dom could pretty much just sit back and do nothing for. That two frame punish. He's got to try to punish him more out of that up B. He's fine. Oh, and there we go. There is a side smash there. Be able to break through that spin dash and get the kill. Still not looking particularly great for uh, for Murph. I think Dom appears to be content with just sitting back the entire time. There's another. Uh, Looks like back there will probably kill at uh, this percent. You're going through a quick commentator switch. Well, I'm not commentating. Oh, you were not commentating. You were. I could possibly commentate. Yes. <laughs> um, who did this volume? This is very, very loud. I see the back there will kill. Not yet. That looks like. Make sure that side smash. And ooh, he just the forward smash seals the deal. Yes. PJ Dom. Taking the game with, uh, against uh, Murph. Homie walks right out the venue like nothing it ever happened.